What's going on guys? This is Bam, or Ravenous Bam for all you people in the Ravenous world. How's everybody doing today? Is it a good day? It is a pretty good day for me. I got off about, uh, I don't know, three. And um, weird that I kind of started this game not moving. I was actually taking a leak. <laughs> Please excuse the language, ladies. <laughs> I was taking a leak and started this game a little late. But this game's kind of special. Before we get too far into it, a couple of quick things about the gameplay. <clears throat> yes, this is a sniping Moab. And before you all get into trolling me about how campy I was playing, because if you don't know me, you would know that I do not play campy at all. Um, this game is actually, it was one of my accomplishments. I mean, it's one of my, it was one of my actual goals in life. <laughs> not, it's kind of bad to say it was my goal in life to get a Moab, but for my Call of Duty experience, it was one of my goals to get a snop in Moab. And, you know, almost a little over two months after the game's out, I finally get one. I've been close one other time, but I've never really tried. <laughs> yeah, it's a kill confirmed game on uh, Interchange. A pretty good map. I like this map a lot. And I end up getting in this pretty good little spot here. I don't, I don't really know how I uh, managed to do this. I don't... I don't really think that I would have been able to do it if I didn't have a couple people playing with me. Uh, so a special thanks to Scott C. and Worthington. You guys are awesome. Help me, guide me through this Moab. I don't know that I could probably do one by myself. It just would be, it would just be too hard. I mean, too too crazy. <clears throat> so yeah, before y'all troll me too much for camping, then just realize that it was just a goal of mine, and now the goal's done, and if I ever get another snap in Moab, I promise you it's going to be super, super fast-paced. And, um, that's about all, I guess. And another thing about Kill Confirmed, and if you're sniping and Kill Confirmed, you don't really run to get your dog tags. Um, most of the time your kills are going to be longer distance than, you know, assault rifle or whatnot. And that, that tag's going to sit there probably for... Four to four to five seconds away from you in a running distance, and all I can say is that's really kind of a dumb move if you want to run and get your tags. Because not only is the spawn system stupid, but you've got depending on if you're playing regular kill confirmed or ground war kill confirmed, you've got at least five to eight other people that are watching their teammate die and going to be looking exactly where they died um, if they're decent players, anyways. Kind of a scary moment, and then I got a hit marker, but uh, I get out of it somehow. But anyway, yeah, uh, actually, it's, this is a pretty hairy moment of the game, but I end up being okay. And the the whole let's run and get our dog tags thing, it works, and to some extent, you you will succeed as it at it. But for the most part, you're if you're sniping and kill confirmed, you're just not gonna really. Uh, I don't really know if you run and get your tags, you're not gonna end up doing right can't believe I got out of this situation honestly I never I never would have ever thought I could get out of that <clears throat> but that's enough about the gameplay I want to talk to you guys about something else today along with the fact that uh, I'm real busy lately with the whole you know getting married in four months and all I just said in my last video um, I did a, a HDPVR giveaway on my channel um, I've gotten one submission for it so far as far as the game I requested and all the rules and stuff, I've had one submission and a few people comment on it saying that they would blah blah blah, this, that, that. Everybody's always got a hundred thousand excuses, but um, not hating on you guys, I'm just saying. The point is, I'm always trying to help the community, so if you, if you really want to be a part of something, all I can say is keep trying and eventually something will happen. And all you gotta do is look for videos like like that, not not necessarily mine, but a video that videos that actually um, make you interact with the community. Say, oh, by the way, I do get a few kills with an ACR, or maybe two or three with an ACR in this game, but that's only because I had like two bullets left in the MSR. Everybody I killed was so far away, I couldn't go get their packs. But yeah, um, if you look for videos like that that get you. Um, interacting with the community, say posting video responses or doing challenges. Like Sniperator did a challenge, or he does challenges. I don't know if he still does them. I haven't watched, or I haven't been really keeping up with it lately. On due to the fact that I've been busy. 
Uh, how about you just repeat yourself like nine times, bam. Okay. Um, but Snipe Hunter does like challenges, montage challenges. You put your clan tag as a certain thing. See what kind of clips you can throw together within a certain period of time. Usually a, two weeks, a week or not actually usually a week. Um, edit it, get it up, and I've done that a couple of times. And honestly, it got me, it got me a f quite a few subscribers. I actually did one that uh, it was. I mean, both of these were Black Ops. Don't know why this guy was so hard to kill. Look at that. Isn't that ridiculous? Stupid. I actually got Scott to kill because that dude was laying there with Dead Man's Hand. Uh. But anyhow. Um, yeah, so I posted a couple of Black Ops uh, montages that were done off Snipinator's challenge. And they both worked out pretty pretty well for me. One of them was actually like seven minutes long. I, took a, I did a lot of work on it and... Um, I was pretty happy with the end result, and it got me a lot of subscribers and a lot more interaction and good feedback, which is what I want. I gotta say that my channel so far has not really had much negativity. Um, I don't really know why, other than the fact that I'm a pretty nice guy. If you're mean to me, I'm gonna not be mean back sometimes. <laughs> I'm pretty pretty big douchebag sometimes. I gotta say, if you're if I feel like you're being wrong in your ways then I'm not afraid to call you out on it and that's about all I can say about I don't know you know everything guys this game is wrapping up it was a 31 and 0 flawless Moab end the game on a nice little three piece I don't even know really how I ended up doing it but there's the uh Moab and I get all ballsy like oh my god I actually ran around the house after I got this game I started I was just screaming Megan was like what are you doing so yeah there you see the nice little three piece to end the game and I just uh pretty happy about it guys sniper Moab if I get another one like I said it will be just completely balls rushing through the whole place but anyways, thanks for watching, guys. If you like what you see on here on Ravenous, then check out my channel for more links and awesome stuff. I didn't even realize that I had my select scoreboard up through the gameplay. Man, so dumb. <laughs> thanks for watching, guys. Later.